So I'm here with Rory with Boondatech, and uh, we're looking at this awesome trailer. Yep, sliding truck camper. It's got the electric jacks. Um, I try to get as much outside storage as possible. So all these doors on the side are storage compartments. Okay. Um, this is an add-on thing. Uh, little shelf storage. I've got my lights in there, but I want to rig it up so it, it's the picnic. Your plates oh, sure. and everything are right yeah. here, so you stay yeah. out. It's on a one-ton truck, Okay. so you can see the height is up. If it's on a 250, you might be a little lower. Okay. This is your waste tank for your um, cassette toilet. Slides out, you can dump it anywhere. People what's, a, what's a cassette toilet? This is, this is a toilet that instead of dumping into a holding tank like most RVs, uh -huh. it has your holding tank here. Okay. The handle, wheels, you can cart it off, put it in uh, any waste, Where, yeah, yeah, rust yeah. area. <laughs> you can carry, if you want to, you can carry it in a McDonald's and dump it, but um, uh, the unit is eight and a half foot long. Uh, queen size bed. Okay, shall we go in? Yeah, go ahead. All go right. ahead. Right in. Just watch your head, low bridge. Oh yeah, very low. <laughs> Definitely watch your head on that. Yeah, come in with a hat on. You always. Oh, it's just. Okay. Come on in. Very cozy. This is what I meant. It's not an RV to sleep six. Oh yeah. Uh, so it's just a base camp. Uh huh. Uh, the. I extended the bed in 20 inches. You have all the storage up here. This nice. one comes with the, the true Macombi, which is ducted furnace and okay. water heater combination. Is that propane it's propane run? 12, 12 volt propane, yes. Okay. The fridge is 12 volt. Okay. It got a 160 uh, watt solar panel on the top, so it's, it's actually charging, which is good. Because I woke up this morning, it was 11.7 volts. It's already up to 12.3. Nice. Underneath the bed, we've got storage. Wow. Is this a king size bed? This is queen. Oh, queen. 60 okay. by 80. Yeah, you got these nice, uh, these nice little uh, campers on the seating side. areas. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I see my dog food up there. She, she, this is her, her bed. But her bed yeah, too. I keep my clothes in the hampers up here. Okay. Uh, 12 volt USB port up there for my phone, so I know what time it is. <laughs> Very cool. And so these, I see that these walls. Um, are like a material so does that mean that the roof exactly. comes down the roof comes up and down electronically there's a push button right here oh so you it's just that simple and going back up each very cool and how long does it take to put the top up when it's fully down i'd say it's like 15 20 seconds to raise it um when when you bring it down of course you use the the vent here to suck shut oh, the door okay. and it actually helps keep the material sure sucks it in okay and then is this like a little uh, window over oh, here? oh yeah the windows are imported they're uh dometic oh uh, okay they're imported from let me get this open uh therm you know thermoplastic okay frames uh gas filled actual windows wow so that means they're really good at super insulated super insulated wow how much does a little window like that run? Compared to what the U.S. version, a window that size would be maybe a hundred dollars. This one's probably three. Okay. But it's just worth it. Yeah, for sure. Um, on a if I got a well, my even my slider window I get for the U.S. and glass, it's framed with aluminum, uh -huh. which transfers heat and cold very well. Okay. And then you have the the mullion and the screen. You just don't get that full vision. Yeah. And and my other units I get bigger of course bigger windows but th this one just happened that these four windows fit really nice very cool but all ducted furnace heats come out uh, wherever I can okay wow that's fantastic so this one's yours or is this this is one I'm yeah I built this but I'm this is uh, the model that I'm going to introduce okay so um, are, are you the the founder of Bunditech yeah well okay I'm Bunditech USA. Okay. Bunditech is a company in, in South Africa that makes the awnings and the rooftop tent. Okay. So in keeping with the Bundu te top, Bundu on, this is going to be Bundu camp. Oh, fantastic. Yeah, I saw there's one over there. That must be the Bundu top? Yeah, the Bundu okay. top is, is, the, is the rooftop, electric roof okay. tent. And okay. it's, it's unique. Uh, you got the glass top stove. 
Oh yeah, check that out. That's propane, yeah? Yeah, it's all propane. That's fantastic. The sink has also got the glass top only. I, I don't know if it's okay. Or, oh yeah, it does, doesn't it? It's got, yeah. Oh, that's nice. Look at that. And this, this pops up and stores down here. But you've got your extra tub, you got your cutting board, your drainage. Wow. And then so cool. for, for traveling, it's just it's just uh, look at this tiny little uh yeah tiny little guy. Hot and cold all the time. Wow. And then is this uh this is uh installed or is this like your addition? No, this is th this sits right here. Okay. Stay up when the roof comes down. Very cool. Awesome. Well thank you so much for showing us their very cool Bundu tag. And there's a little toilet. <laughs> this is the cassette toilet, yes. Okay. It swivels out. Oh, interesting. Look at that. Uh, and this, and there's a sink for it as well. Yes. I see you got another little the, another little window over there. Oh yeah, I should open that up. The um and then it does have screens that come up. Oh cool. Oh it, nice. It, the, yeah, if you open it. The roof vent up there is also uh, thermal pane. And it opens up all the way if you want to look at the stars at night. Oh, really The cool. one thing pulls over screen, the one thing pulls over, it's an insulated cover. Fantastic. I and then is this just a storage piece yeah, up here? this is just... A awesome. Towel closet. Yeah, and uh, the ones I'm going to make for the short beds, this will be the... I can actually put a shower pan in here. Oh, okay. So I'll actually have a shower. Yeah. I, I've learned from my trip to Africa that the interior shower is not that big of a deal. So I... Oh, yeah. But, but the toilet is. <laughs> so you're right, right? Yeah. So, <laughs> so you've got a shower on this on the outside? Yes, is there's that an correct? outside shower on this. Oh, yes. fantastic. Can we take a look really quick? Yeah. Your water port is here, the water station. Okay. Nice. This hose just clips into here. Got a spray, ho spray ho holder. Sorry. That's okay. And here's your. Very cool. More there of a wash shower. down, but it can be a shower. It's sure. hot and cold. And is your hot water heater is that propane? Did you yes, say? Yes, it okay. is. Yep. Yeah, that's how it's designed. Is here's your LP storage, your battery, your water tank, um, your water heater. It's all up front ahead of the okay. axle. So I'm trying to keep center gravity low. Sure. Very use cool. A, use a torque lift tie downs. Okay. Frame mount. So if you are off road, you're not going to um, wreck your box. Yeah. Wow. All, all LED lights. That's another thing that's. Okay. Yeah. Really, for solar. For yep. Yep. Preserving your battery. Yeah. When you're out in the bush, that's the last thing you want. It's a dead battery. Yeah. Really. <laughs> well, fantastic. Can we take a look at this one really quick? Yep. Yeah. Definitely. And so you said this is. Oh yeah, the Bundu top. Okay. And this yeah. one is going to be the Bundu camp. camp. Okay. So the the Bundu top is. Um, you know, a roof-mounted tent. You could they can mount it on a trailer. Um, I I had it on a defend when I was in Africa. They had it mounted on the Defender 110. Okay, that's cool. You so that's one as well. Or no, you no, just said no. you can put it on yes. something like that. Yep. Okay. No, they've contacted me. Shoot, has contacted me. They they're from Wisconsin. Oh, okay. My neck of the woods. But this is 12 volt operated. It's got a four-inch bed mat in it. And how many people does it sleep? I would put two in there. It's a 54 by 82 mattress inside. Okay. But the rain, the rain fly deploys automatically, goes in automatically. Oh yeah, that's nice. Instead of having to push it in. Yeah, it's engineered really, really slick. Keep awesome. Your, keep your bedding in there. It's it's watertight, dust tight. I I can attest to that because uh -huh. the. Def my friend slept in the Defender, and every night we had to take a broom and broom the dust out. Oh. My, I slept in here. Never. <laughs> Never. It was Everything was dry. Now, is that a little light that I see in there? Yes. Yep. Yeah, it's got a 12-volt light. It's got a 12-volt outlet. Okay. Wow. An outlet, too. That's awesome. Yeah. yeah well, if you were sleeping in there last night, I, I think the 12-volt electric blanket would have come in handy. Oh, nice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Cool. Can I take a look? Sure. Okay. Yep. Be careful. Really tough. 
I liked it because it was dark inside. Yeah, it is cool. It's, it's nice and dark. If, I, if you want light, you just zip the window open. I love the pattern on top. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Very cool. So and this... Enter, this When you mount it, you can enter it on it. You know, the windows are on all four sides. So this material is called Riptite, you said? Ripstop. Oh, Ripstop. Okay. Very durable. Oh, that's fantastic. Well, thank you so much, Rory, for the tour. That's really fantastic. Yeah, it's nice to meet you guys. It's good. I'm, I'm glad I got into this expedition, expo, but uh -huh. it's the type of people. It's, it's a whole different market than a typical RV. For sure, yeah. You know? it's, yeah, it's very much more adventurous, you know, yes. off-roady and uh, yep. pretty cool. Very and nice. Weather like this, people just take it in stride. Yeah. It's Mother Nature. Yeah, absolutely. That they add her best. All right, well, good luck with the expo. Yes, yep, yep. Nice right. meeting you. You too. Yeah, All right. Thanks.